Don's a great man. I'm Dr. Bob Agnew, and a really nice guy. A uh, really nice guy. And I produced. Uh, this is my second CD. Uh, the first one I did was produced uh, released ten years ago, and this one was the last three years. So I'm not a very prolific writer, but this is a special one because it's uh, my thoughts and impressions over the last three years. There's a cute picture on the front, uh, and I want everybody to know that they get a free copy of this. It's right up on the desk. Uh, and there's a second CD up there, and that's the one that we did four years ago at the high school band. There's copies up there for, for that also. But this is a cute picture that was actually uh, taken from the 1961 um, yearbook, whereas seniors, we were asked to uh, submit a baby picture. And so I submitted a baby picture. And, but it was always, and we didn't get the print back. They kept the print. But I always liked that picture. And the name of this album is entitled Always Saturday. And as when we might remember when we were three or four years old, every day was Saturday. <laughs> so I thought it'd be very apropos to resurrect this uh, photograph from the uh, 1961 yearbook. It was about an inch big, and it had a big number written on it. And my friend Ike over here, he removed the number, and Kurt worked on it some. And we got it to where it was really presentable. And it's a picture of me and my first girlfriend, Sally, <laughs> and my dog, my first dog, Patches. And we're sitting in the backyard of our home in Cincinnati. And my mom shot this picture. And it is a, just a cute picture. On the back uh, are some other photographs taken more recently of my puss. But on the inside, I'd like to Read what it says. And it says, to my fellow band members, three years in the making, this is my second CD, and it is a tribute to the one responsible, Dr. Alan Drake. His excellence as a musician and teacher has touched all of our lives. His footprints enriched our lives forever. We learned from him that in the race for quality, there was no finish line. To focus on the critical few, not the insignificant many. From him, we learned to embrace optimism. And that excellence was never an act. It was a habit. Thanks to this great teacher, I have learned that music creates a powerful universe of individual introspection. Its power to transport us, to move and thrill us, is based on the composer who created it from within his soul. I hope you enjoy these 15 original compositions, each one a very musical journey crafted from my heart and dedicated to our men. Dedicated to our magnificent teacher and friend, Dr. Alan Drake. So be sure to grab one on your way. And uh, my email address and website are in here. Let me know what you think. Without further ado, and thank you, Dr. Allen, for playing tonight. It was wonderful. We finally got to do it. <laughs> we missed all of that last time. Thank you so much. Hey, thank you. Um, I, I wanted to say, too, also, the two gentlemen who have really spent, uh, put this thing together, put the other one, the uh, dinner with Greg, together, were Kurt Ulig and Bob Schultz. 
Yeah. I want to thank them. And then Bob has, has kind of gotten in on it now that he's... And Peggy. And Peggy. And Peggy. Peggy Schultz. And let's see, who else? Well, he's, he's been hanging around uh, um, Kurt's place for a while, so he's been getting in on the planning, right? Yeah. <laughs> so thank you all so much for putting this on. It was a delight to have you, all of you here. It was a delight to see these people again. Great old friends. And uh, I wish you many, many, many years of happiness. And I've had many. <laughs> I appreciate that. So thank you all so much.